Akron police are looking for the person responsible for stealing a man's motorized scooter, a scooter that for the disabled victim was his only way of getting around. News Channel 5's John Kosick joins us now from the newsroom with more on this Summit County story. And Danita, we don't know who stole it, so we don't know why they did it. What we do know is the impact it had on the man who relied on it. I was in tears. You were in tears? Yeah. Rodney Proctor couldn't believe it when he learned that his motorized scooter, like this one, had been stolen from outside his friend's Akron apartment. She discovered the theft Saturday morning while walking her dog. I said, Rodney, how did you get here? And he says, I brought my scooter. So what happened is the scooter was gone. Rodney's cerebral palsy makes even simple tasks difficult. For most of his 47 years, he refused to let the disorder get the better of him. But earlier this year, he realized he now needed help. He got a scooter, and his world opened up. I went everywhere with that chair, even to work. With it gone, he was at a loss. Without that chair, I could not go nowhere. Fortunately for him, Miller's health care products stepped up, not with a temporary chair, but this one, a permanent replacement. I'm grateful that people are willing to help and had the courage to help somebody. And to those who stole his chair and threatened his freedom, he has a message. Don't ever do, do it to me again because the cop will, uh, will get them. Well, the cops want to get them for that first offense, and they want your help. Anyone with any information in this case is asked to call Akron Police. Reporting live in the newsroom, John Kasich, News Channel 5. Well, so hopefully someone watching the story tonight will have some information and the police can catch the person who took his wheelchair. Exactly. Thank you, John.